Hello, it's Friesen van here and here we are with the new house build. This is on the same lot as the last house build that I built was. It's also a vacation rental home. And uh, you will see me build it. This one is going to be for a bit more sims, the one that I'm currently copying furniture from has four beds and this one is gonna have six beds six sleeping places because of course one is a double and you can see me right here trying to figure out a layout how this could work best so I uh, it's a Friday right now And I will explain why it's a Friday while I'm doing this voiceover. So yesterday was Thursday, that's the upload date for house builds for me. And uh, that's what I did, I uploaded this video and then today I checked back and I saw that there was no functioning sound, I think not the last Bachelor Red Challenge uh, video had that, the, the one before I think. Which of course is very annoying because I am not the best at, how, uh, at, at voice overing so it was a bit of a letdown finding out that I had to do one more voice over again. But yeah, here we are, we're doing it. So if you're wondering why is this video late, it's because the sound messed up again. So here we are, second try. Let's do this. So this house build uh, is on this lot, the same lot as the last house build. It's the one, it's uh, a one a house build that could be on a vacation rental home property thing and that's why we're doing this because uh, it's a pandemic we aren't really uh, able to just go anywhere on vacation if we want to and, and for that reason I decided to build myself a couple of rental homes. So here we are doing that. And as I said, this one is going to be a bit bigger. Not much, but just a bit. And that's what's going on. I uh, just got myself a ticket to see the Five Sakes of Summer concert next year. Fingers crossed by then it's going to be in April. We have a vaccine and we can battle this coronavirus by vaccinating, which would be lovely. You see also, I'm going to try to do this voice over the best I can. You can also see me copying uh, furniture from the other house that's on this lot. Uh, the reason why I'm doing that is because uh, as this is on a vacation park situation, um, it made sense that there is a theme throughout the furniture in this build in both the houses and I think I might even build uh, one more there is room for one more on this lot uh, I haven't done it yet so don't ask when but first uh, within two weeks next Thursday this the video will be up I just haven't built it yet I will go soon I guess
and this house is also CC free so no custom content in any of these builds which is nice it's as I said in the test build not something that I usually do usually I don't build <coughs> with uh, just stuff from the games itself I have a lot of what do I have a lot? I have some uh, custom content that I just always uh, implement in my build good word proud of myself for that sort of so that's what I'm trying to do just uh, with the content that came in the game which is a tiny bit annoying because I think I explained this in, this in the, the last build before this I was planning on doing this wall with only wardrobes because I think it's uh, beneficial if you have a lot of storage in a house like this because it's not that big and every bit of storage is useful that's why we put these uh, double sided cabinets above the counter Yes, that's what we're doing at least and behind the couch we're putting extra cabinets in and then of course like in the other house this wall with uh, cabinets and a TV and bookshelves to make it some kind of a unit and here as beds and tables the same counters because for some strange reason that makes sense, made sense in my head, so that's what I'm doing it. Because why not? But yeah, next year I'm gonna see 5 seconds of summer. I'm glad that I am, because I was looking forward to it. And uh, there is just one downside. So this year they were supposed to play a festival, a one day festival in the Belgium and me and my friend were gonna go there we were both looking forward to it and then of course corona hit and now we're here and that concert is postponed but uh, they uh, um, now that five six of summer announced all the tour dates we know that they won't be uh, able to play the dates of that festival next year because they are somewhere else in the world touring so I don't really need to be at this festival anymore uh, the reason I went was because of 5 seconds of summer and now that they're not going I don't see a reason why I should be going there but they are not um, not yet at least uh, giving our money back which is great of course because I definitely didn't need that money anyway I do but they don't care so yeah we, the, they said that we will have to wait till uh, September to hear what they will do with it September is like two months away we're just uh, in the first one of the first week of July and that's great so we would just have to wait sit still here and hope that we can get our money refunded to us strange because 5 seconds of summer was also gonna play at Pink Pop that's a Dutch festival and uh, I think people that had tickets to that could already decide what they wanted. They wanted money back or um, just tickets for next year, something like that. Or maybe a voucher, maybe. So yeah, that's great, we have to wait. So now I have tickets to that concert and I 
didn't get my money back from the last concert, so that's, that's just fantastic. Luckily, I have, haven't had a vacation plan, so I have my vacation money, which I could spend. So that's nice, yes, kind of nice, maybe. This house has two full baths. And none of them are on suites. Bathroom. You can see me trying to figure out if I could place a window there, but it was uh, the only reason I could have done it was with move objects on, and I didn't want to turn it on, so no window at the landing place. I'm at this moment not uh, super excited for this concert next year, but I think that's mostly because nobody knows when this coronavirus is going to be done. So this concert is planned, but that doesn't mean that it's going to really happen. April is like super far away, but still. <coughs> so yeah, I'm just uh, waiting it out. You can see that we're now done with the inside. This lovely house build. That's great. Uh, we're now doing this lounge set on the patio. And then behind this, uh, this row of bushes. Talking is so hard. Uh, I am putting down a dining table area. And I think that's also one of the last things I do. I figure out a better way to place them. And that's, uh, I think, one of the last things I do. There, of course, are screenshots at the end of the video of this house build with the layout and a couple of inside screenshots. Not that big of a house, so not a lot of screenshots. But I am gonna wrap it up right here for me. If you enjoyed this video, thumbs it up, uh, subscribe to my channel, so you see the next video, it's Tuesday, let's play, it's on Tuesday, and house builds are on Thursday every other week. My name is Friesen Fan, and I hope you have a lovely day, goodbye.